Hello, and welcome back to Monster Hunter Sunbreak. You already know how it goes. I pick a quest, pick two followers, and we go on it. And for today, we have Elder Fugen with the Longsword, of course, and Rondine with the Longsword, of course. This should be pretty interesting to say the least. So let's get to it. And our opponent this time is Gold Rathian once again. However, I'm not bringing the Swan Shield this time, I'm bringing the Heavy Bowgun. And if that's the reason why I brought Longsword with Elder Fugen and Rondine. The Gold Rathian should be completely annoyed by the presence of Longswords and completely focus on them. They me completely open to gun her down. And looks like Rondine and Elder Fugen don't have a support compensation, but. They have different longswords, one from the Royal Order and one from Camora, which look very nice side to side. Let's go! Let's go! And fittingly, I'm All using right. the Royal Order Hey Bowman. Doing great! <laughs> with well a Coalesce build, progress. just like with this light bowgun. So I will do big damage by killing myself. I'm gonna get you! Like a true bold and use. At least that's settled. complete! And he's a small oh. gold rack. And when you're using bold you want to be for the egg. And the tape. With range weapon maybe. Ah, thankfully that doesn't do I think we can get out. I tend to forget how... I already forgot what I said. But anyway, you know the drill. This time I win a bit extender, so... Get away from Brandon and it's rich so I can be protected. And when I'm away, here's two or three speed. And we leave it extender, get out of the way quite easily. And continue in for the head and for the way. Fairly straightforward. Right and let's see if Elder Fugen will throw it against Angela. Yep, he does. We got him where we want it. Very nice. Sweet move. Whoops. Too late for that, but Rondine should do a good job. 
With the wild ride, I am too busy pressing buttons. Like a true Bogan main, I don't think I simply press buttons and it works. What everyone else has to see. Look at that, I don't need to get close, I just sit here and shoot. And I already ran out of ammo. Like a true heavy bow in me, I don't think I attack and I run out of ammo. And I get hit in the face. And there she goes. Speaking of which, I didn't mention it last video, but I got an ancient uh, basal juice mantle from a shiny drop, so make sure to get as many shiny drops as possible. You never know what you will get. Now I recharge my ammo. The Pierce ammo level 2 and 3 being the most important ones, since I want to stay at range. Tired into the squid, which is really nice. I'm fighting this one, but only fighting. Oh god, my super damage. Firewalls are my favorite to go down. Easy to dash. Easy to see coming. Yeah, 
And just like I predicted, she got completely distracted with the one shot user. So she did not. I can freely aim at her legs or her tail. And Basil Deus is out here for a rematch. Since she remembers how I bullied her with her ego run. So she decides, you know what? It's time for Rathia to get bullied, bullied by the heavy ball at this time. And that's going like an Amazon. That's hey rolling for you. It's in quite That's some great mounting. You are exceptionally good at this. You know what? Why not? Here, get traps. I'm out of here. Well, no talk. Head empty. Just heavy bow gun. What an invigorating hunt. <laughs> Not the world I would use, but I'll take it. And that's a Rathian Mantle! Last time Beastly just Mantle, this time a Rathian Mantle. Never break the streak. I mean, I already broke it a few hunts ago, but... The frequency is what counts. The male scenarios have returned, so let's send him away immediately. It's important to get these shiny things, such as shiny bones or shiny mushrooms and whatnot, because they are used for special armor. Now then, let's finally see what the Dory has to say for a change. <clears throat> Greetings, R. There is something I wish to discuss with you. An afflicted monster has attacked a nearby village, injuring some of its residents, and now those poor souls have fallen ill with affliction. I thought my medicine for treating Fiorain would suffice, but the virus has evolved, rendering my medicine ineffective. However, with the recent discovery of a flaming Espinas, we may have a chance. If these beasts are as toxic as they say, we may be able to increase the medicine's potency using toxin. Risky, but we have no other choice. <sighs> Chiche has to request to hunt the beast. Time is of the essence, if we are to save the villagers. I leave the rest to you. Cheers! I have an assignment for you, from Dr. Tadori. You are to hunt a flaming Espina so that he may extract its poison. Uh -huh. He says that its poison is even more potent. Wait, even more potent poison? Oh dear. I feel faint. Apologies, as a princess, I don't do well around poison. But enough about me. Do be careful out there. A special quest has been added! Whole bunch of quests done. And that's the urgent flaming Espinas quest. I look forward to your safe return. For next time. Hmm. Now that I think about it, that hunt went exactly as if I were Luchica herself using her bowgun. This weapon truly embodies her, her spirit. No thoughts. Hit empty, just bow gun. Have a nice day.